What is up you guys? My name is Curtis from Sports Gamers Online and I am live at PAX East. Well, I'm probably not live because you're just watching this video, but we're about to interview Liam, the game director of Curse to Golf. Now, Curse to Golf is an awesome game, a game that I've been kind of following recently because it just looks so much fun. I got to play the game myself and the game looks amazing. It feels great already. And of course, it has a summer release date of this year. So we're about to interview Liam. So make sure you guys subscribe to Sports Gamers Online, all right? Hi everybody, I'm Liam. I'm the game director of a game called Curse to Golf. We're here at PAX at the Thunderful booth. Uh, Curse to Golf is this strange, uh, golf game that we've made. Uh, we call it a golf-like. It kind of combines both, you know, traditional golf games like inspired by like old Konami golf games or Neo Geo Turf Masters uh, and roguelikes. So it's uh, closest kin might be games like Slay the Spire or something like that. Um, it's very heavily inspired by roguelikes, but we call it a golf-like just to be safe. So don't expect too much on the roguelike front. Um, but the idea is that you are a golf pro. You're kind of the Tiger Woods of your day. And as you're about to win, like the final tournament, the biggest prize you ever could win, uh, you unfortunately are struck by lightning and you die. And then you are cursed to golf as you are sent down to golf purgatory, uh, passing golf hell. And then it's your task to show that you are truly the greatest and you can golf through the 18 holes of golf purgatory. Uh, so these 18 holes are made up of about 70 different levels we have that you random every time you play. And the idea is that you can smash these idols to gain shots back and like you only have five shots to get to the flag and then you can use these cards so we have these power-up cards uh, where you can like change the di direction of the ball or go through portals or you can like uh, change the ball into ice and all these different cool wacky powers that are really heavily inspired by stuff like Mario Kart and other roguelites uh, so combining all those things together including your golf skill hopefully you can make it through golf purgatory and then you go back to life. <laughs> what is some of the, uh, the inspiration for the art style? Because it's very a retro. Uh, yeah. Um, so originally I made a prototype by myself and I am not a good artist whatsoever. <laughs> so I just used like my reference of like loving uh, Super Famicom, Super Nintendo games. Uh, so I try to emulate that Mario world style. Uh, so when we actually gained an artist who is called John Davies, he's based in the UK. Uh, he knew what kind of style I wanted, which was like, imagine if you found an undiscovered Super Nintendo game that no one knew about and it's about golf. Mm. So the entire inspiration is trying to stick, uh, not too faithfully, but make it look like a Super Nintendo game, like a really rad Super Nintendo game that nobody's played before. And uh, yeah, that's exactly what we went for. Uh, but we have this combination of uh, all of the game world and all of the animations are pixel art, um, but the UI, and all of the cards, they're all like uh, vector art mm -hmm. to make it look like an old Konami golf game. Mm -hmm. So they have like checkerboards and it's meant to look a bit golfy. So we have this like clash of two styles. Uh, we're really happy with it. We love it. We get a lot of positive feedback about especially like all the animations and John killed it. He smashed it out of the, the park. The game looks amazing. Now you guys did say that there is a summer 2022. Is there an exact date? Is there is not. Sorry, there is not oh, an exact date yet. I was uh, hoping to get that. Yeah, yet. not no no <laughs> Jeff Keighley World exclusives yet. Um, but we are hopefully launching in summer 2022. We are in the last final stages of development uh, ourselves, like putting it all together. We learned a lot of feedback from people playing the demo. Uh, it's out now on Steam. You can check it out. Uh, we took a lot of that feedback, uh, most of it positive, thankfully, <laughs> and uh, we're now we're trying to balance the game, make sure that the 18 holes that you play through are as fun and as challenging as you want it to be. Uh, yeah, so this Fantastic, summer, Liam. please play. This summer, this summer, curse the golf. Yeah. If you guys like the content we do here on Sports Gamers Online, then hit that like button and subscribe to SGO right now. And if you want the most out of your SGO experience, then join SGO Insider.